Good morning, good morning. Welcome to 4x8 Paper Stuff. Another day in my vacation videos, me trying to draw something. If you know me, and if you've watched any of my videos, you know I can't draw. I try. But I wanted to look more professional than a third grader. So I photocopied a, I downloaded a picture off of Google Images of a little thatched cottage. We are going to spend quite a few nights in the Cotswold, so I'm imagining we'll see one or two of these houses hopefully. And I am going to add this to a journal spot somewhere in my travel journal when I get home. Um, this is behind the scenes. Um, so I, I kind of just, I'm drawing this, tracing this onto uh, cardstock with carbon paper. And I'm just getting the main bodies of everything, not the little flower details or anything like that. I want to paint it with watercolors. Um, I might add bushes in the front just with greens and then later come in with maybe pens or pencils and add a couple little blossoms or something. But um, I have I have other images there like Big Ben and a banner and the beef eater and maybe the queen. I don't know. Um, but there is no more queen, so that's kind of dated. But anyhow, so today I'm just focusing on a cute little cottage, uh, a thatched roof cottage. And I really, um, spoiler alert, I like how this turns out. It is good enough for my journal. Um, not perfect, but good for what I want. And it's not like everybody else's. I really, 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 really am to the point in life where I don't want my stuff to look like everybody else's. Which is fine if you want. I do get kits from certain people, Ali Edwards. Um, but not every day do I want the same travel stuff that everybody else has. So I like doing some of this stuff on my own too. It, it, will I use it? It, it, it? it may come to the point where at the end of the day, I'm like, I don't want to use this. But for right now, I think I like it a lot. Um, so anyhow... I'm going to paint this with my little uh, watercolor set here and just kind of add browns where they're supposed to be browns and creams where they're supposed to be like, I don't know what they use. We call it stucco here. I don't know what they use. Um, oh, I can't, I didn't, there's a name for some of this that, on the tip of my tongue, but anyhow. Um, I just... I love the little English thatched cottage, it's kind of like, what's that movie that um, Cameron Diaz was in where she traded houses for the Christmas holidays with a friend and they turn out to, you know, a, a, a rom-com. Anyhow, I love that little cottage, the English little countryside cottage. I think that is so cute. Um, and the fact that it has low ceilings and low doorways doesn't bother me in the slightest because I'm a short little person. Anyhow, that's neither here nor there. So this is so much fun. Um, it's getting me in the mood to go because I'm filming these a few days in advance. Um, it's getting me in the mood to go. Um, I, I've already said, but just to remind you, I'm not going to do a video every day while I'm gone. I've planned like four, maybe five, if I get them all together, um, videos for while I'm gone. And I think I'm gone 14 days. Um, I, I still don't know for sure. Um, I'm kind of just letting my hand, husband handle all that part. And he tells me when to get up early to go to the airport. Um, so anyhow, so much fun. So much fun. And this is kind of my travel setup. What I'm going to take is just a little tiny travel. Well, you saw where I made the travel palette of gouache. This same water brush and a little tiny 4 by 4 journal. And... Maybe in the end of the day, I'll get to draw something. I don't know. Um, if I don't, I don't. I'm not going to stress out over it. Uh, it's still not enough to take up an entire, you know, section of a suitcase. Teeny tiny. Um, and I'm, I'm going light, uh, trying to just focus on the moments that happen while they happen. Um, I think sometimes I try to... Sometimes I have... In the past, I have tried to journal every day, and I find that I miss out on some of the being present, and I really want to be present. 
This will probably be the only time I get to go to this part of the world, so I really want to enjoy it. Um, <clears throat> and I get to enjoy it in advance because I'm making a little thatched cottage in the countryside, uh, right here and now, and having, you know, thoughts of, you know, are we going to see this? Are we going to see that? I do watch a couple people on YouTube that live in England. Um, I would love to take a summer and just go on a canal boat, but alas, life, you know, happens and that's not going to happen. Um, so this is, you know, I've never seen Buckingham Palace. I've never, we've only been to Heathrow and only to transfer planes. I've never been in England otherwise. Um, Ireland, yes. Uh, Scotland, no, I would love to do all that, but this gets me in the mood. I'm, I'm packing as we speak, uh, just kind of putting out my favorite rain hat and getting, uh, a couple outfits. Do I fit in them? Yes, I fit in them. Uh, they're not too small. Um, yes, I have good walking shoes. Yes, uh, we have adapters. Just, you know, getting this stage right now is what, what's happening, um, thinking about, oh gosh, is it going to be too cold? I'm only taking a jean jacket. Um, you know, we are there in August, so I'm hoping. I know England is finicky weather-wise. Um, what do you call this? Lime walls? Is that what they call them? Lime? Anyhow, um, these are supposed to be like bushes, and I'm just adding color to them at this point when it's completely dry. I'll come in and add maybe tiny, tiny little bits of color for like blossoms in the bushes or whatever. Maybe these are azaleas. Do, does England have azaleas? I don't know. We have them here in the South. Um, anyhow, just, just thinking, oh, fish and chips. I love fish and chips. Now I should not have fried food, but depending on what the doctor says in a couple days, I'm not going to think about it while I'm in England. I won't go overboard, but I will be partaking in some fish and chips for sure and uh, a good English roast I hear about that all the time um well that which I think is just like a mini version of Thanksgiving <laughs> so um I'm excited for all of that all we both are we really are um so in the meantime I have a cottage just in case I need it for my journal which I think will be adorable thanks for watching see you next time bye